Derived from the Tornado IDS to meet specific RAF requirements, the Tornado ADV, air defense variant, was designed for effective long-range interception. Its key enhancements included the incorporation of the Fox Hunter radar and an elongated fuselage to accommodate semi-recessed sky flash air-to-air -air missiles. The transitional F.MK2 variant was later replaced by the definitive F.MK3 version. Starting in 1986, the RAF began receiving the initial batch of 152 production F.MK3s, which underwent subsequent updates over time. The Stage 1 upgrade introduced features such as hands-on throttle and stick controls, radar-absorbent material coating, and flare dispensers. The Stage 2 enhancement further improved the computer systems and radar imagery, incorporating the Joint Tactical Information Datalink. Although the highly anticipated Eurofighter Typhoon was initially intended to replace the F.MK3, the RAF took an interim approach by enhancing 100F. MK3s through the Capability Sustainment Program CSP. This upgrade involved integrating AIM-120 AMRAM and OSRAM capabilities, albeit without fully exploiting the potential of these weapons due to limitations in digital avionics and helmet-mounted sites. The CSP also brought a multi-target engagement capability for the radar and enhanced defensive aids. The Common Operational Value COV, modification included structural adjustments, a night vision goggles compatible cockpit with new displays, GPS, and secure have quick radios. The first aircraft with CSP-COV modifications were returned to RAF units in 2000. The RAF's F.MK3 fleet, consisting of five frontline units and an operational conversion unit OCU, is stationed at Koningsby, Lutchers, and Leeming. Saudi Arabia acquired 24 new F.MK3s, while Italy leased 24 upgraded XRAF F.MK3s starting in 1995 as interim fighters until their Eurofighter Typhoons became operational. The Tornado ADVs saw action in combat alongside these three nations, participating in conflicts such as Desert Storm, engagements in the former Yugoslavia, and other NATO peacekeeping missions. The introduction of operational Eurofighters into the RAF's inventory in 2005 led to surplus Tornado F.MK3s being repurposed for various combat support roles. Although these airframes may require additional structural modifications, they could potentially be equipped with radar targeting avionics and alarm anti-radar weapons to address a recognized deficiency in NATO's defense suppression capabilities.